In my role as an executive assistant, I tend to use Neo for finding information and finding people to help me set up meetings as well as create presentations for my vice president. One of the features I really find useful on Neo is the org chat function. Uh, this allows me to contact the right person as and when I need it. Um, one of the challenges though I've noticed on Neo is having the right information, uh, making sure it's up to date. And I think it would be really helpful if we can all keep our profiles and job roles as well as location updated. I think everyone will find that very useful. How do I use NEO and why is NEO important to me as a leader? Uh, I travel a lot around Asia Pacific and I'm, on any given day I could be in Melbourne, I could be in Sydney, I might be in Ho Chi Minh City or Singapore or Tokyo or anywhere else. And I use status updates just to let people know, hey, today I'm in Ho Chi Minh City, I'm travelling with our great Vietnam team, we're going to visit some customers, or I'm in Sydney doing a town hall or whatever it might be. I use the blogging uh, for uh, longer form uh, stories about how we're driving innovation in the business, the sort of ways we're helping customers. Uh, it's really important we bring that focus to, to the business and, and Neo is a great, a great way to do that. It's really interesting now when I talk to people who join Pearson uh, and they start using Neo. People who've come in some cases from big organisations uh, who tell me we didn't have anything like Neo at my, last, at my last job. When I joined Pearson last year I knew that I was going to need to communicate with colleagues around the world in different marketing teams and um, I was pleased to have the opportunity to work with Jive again because I had in my previous role in, in another company. Um, so it was good to work with a, a platform that gives us the opportunity to not just share things, because obviously we have a lot of documents and so forth in marketing that we need to share with people, but also uh, interact, invite comments, invite collaboration, get other people to put their stuff up as well so it's a really good collaborative space for us. We also have a lot of calls where we speak to people in video conference and partly to kind of break up the call but also because it's useful we'll often take them through the, um, the Neo space and the pertinent um, items, the news pieces that we've got there so that we can you know showcase what we're doing visually and it saves in that way it saves us on doing PowerPoint presentations um, it's also useful um, to avoid endless bitty email um, rather than answering a single email to a single person about one thing. We answer our questions on, on Neo, which means that everybody gets to see the answers to, to the questions that people have day to day. It's actually important to take a minute to think about what life was like before we had Neo. We really had no way of finding out what was going on around Pearson. The only real communication we had was, was email. Uh, it was really hard to find out who was doing what, what were the cool things were happening, where could I find information around about what, what was happening in different parts of the world, how can I connect with colleagues in different parts of the world. All that was pretty tough. When Neo came along, it really created a whole new world for, to, for Pearson to think about and ways in which we could communicate and network with each other and create a really connected Pearson community. It's been an incredible um, development in Pearson and Pearson's culture, actually, in that time. And I think you'll find Neo a fantastic resource. Yeah.